In this video, I'm going to show you how to do a multiplayer drawing with Visio. So with Visio, pages are often used a lot since you can put a lot of information on a single drawing. What I've got here is a data center design. It's got the standard uh, distribution and uh, core switches. This is sometimes referred to as three tier when you include the access switches. However, this is just a layer three drawing. Then there's a connection up to some firewalls and also some internet routers. And finally, a WAN connection. See, there's a lot of information here. This drawing is uh, completed with IP addressing and uh, including host name and model. And uh, there's HA as well. You can see there's routing information, including static routing, OSPF. So the host names for these distribution switches are DC Dist 1 and DC Dist 2. And these are Catalyst 9400 switches. You notice in the drawing, these distribution switches, they've got an arrow pointing to the wiring closets. So this is a logical uh, connection. So you notice I've got two tabs here. I've got this data center. That's what this is. And I've got floor one. Go to floor one here. And this is a physical layer drawing. And this is uh, typical of a wiring closet, similar to the uh, Visio physical drawing. It's got the four connections here to each distribution switch. This is what you do with a multi-floor design. There's often a lot of um, similar characteristics with each uh, wiring closet. So the easiest thing to do if there's, say, 10 floors, you just uh, duplicate the first one, and that would be page 3, and then just rename it uh, Floor 2. Since you've already got a template design. So Floor 1, Floor 2 is a duplicate. So at this point, all you have to do is change the interfaces right here, the top. This is already grouped, so you could ungroup it, or if not, you can just select it twice. All you have to do is just change the interfaces, the top here, based on the connection to the distribution switches. So this makes it a lot easier when you've already got a single design, you've got multiple floors, to use this duplicate feature on the floors and just customizing the drawing and making the changes based on the wiring closet. Often it's only, like I said, changing the interfaces here, since they're going to different ports, You'll also have to change the host names and occasionally maybe the uh, model of the uh, device, such as the wireless access point, for example. And that concludes the uh, video.